Uh, they arrive in the dead of night, as you said, and uh, the, the curfew at that White Plains Airport is midnight, uh, and these planes are flying in way after curfew. And then there are charter buses and a police escort waiting for them. And we just observed uh, two flights from Westchester and one from uh, into Westchester and one uh, that left Jacksonville that came to White Plains um, last week. And of those, we saw about 100 migrants come off each plane. And um, we, we followed a couple of buses that went one to Long Island uh, to drop uh, some of these migrants off uh, at about 1 a.m. at a sort of a group home, a former orphanage. Now they have a contract there, Mercy First, with the federal government to house migrant mm. youth. Um, there were several adults that, uh, as far as I could see and my photographer could see, that came off these planes as well. The government is telling us they're all children, but it doesn't look like that to us. But regardless, it's all been done secret secretly. And, and if uh, the, the federal government was not trying to hide what they were doing, they would show us who was on the plane and they would tell us where they were taking right. them and they wouldn't be doing these flights in the dead of night. It seems indisputable.